Is your affiliate marketing funnel not making money? And are you frustrated because you're not closing sales, you're not getting any new leads, and things are just not working for you? Listen, I'm going to give you some tips today on why your sales funnel is not working and how you can make it better. That's coming up next. Hey everybody, this is Eddie Sand, and today I'm going to give you a quick presentation, a quick show and tell presentation on why your affiliate marketing sales funnel is not working. So why is your marketing funnel not making money? It's because of one thing. It's your mindset. Yeah, it is. Your mindset is, it's being hacked. Your mindset has been hacked. It sure has. Why do I say that? Because I'm sure you have heard of, I'm going to type it, I'm going to write it here, funnel hacking. Have you heard of that before? If you haven't, well, look it up. But I'm sure many of you have. Your mindset has been hacked. And let me explain why. What a funnel is, Oops, what a funnel is, is practically something that looks like this. Okay, with a little thing on top. And all these people, right, are coming in through your funnel. And eventually, they come out into your path of whatever it is that you're offering, right? They get into your nice little path. You know, people here, they may be happy, joy, joy, and saying, hey, what a great ride. And, you know, they're going to get to your final offer, right? Whatever that is. Okay? So that's what a funnel may look like, right? Let me let me make that a real funnel. Yeah, just like that. So that's a funnel. So you have heard of funnel hacking, right? So you're hacking somebody else's or some of the business, finding out what's working, what's the offer from right here, and you kind of work yourself backward to know how it is, like from point A to point B, how is this business doing it, right? Business, a person, uh, whatever, right? Whoever you're, you're hacking. Okay, now here is the problem with this. Because your mindset has her hacking, think about it. Think about it for a moment. What is hacking? When you think of a hacker, what do you think? Your mindset is thinking danger is bad. It's like stealing. It's not the right thing to do. And you're hiding. You're sneaking. You're being as you're sneaking in into somebody else's business to rob them of what they have worked hard for. That's why hacking. Your mindset thinks hacking is. So you connect the funnel to hacking. Now you're thinking that your mindset, okay? I'm not saying you, but your mindset subconsciously is thinking that you need to get a bunch of this little dudes right here, right? This people into, into this funnel, no matter the cost. This right here is just not going to work for you. And I'm going to show you what is. So what you should be thinking of is how can you attract, attract the right or ideal prospect, right? Or lead. Okay. Attract leads. All right. That is your main goal to attract. So when your mindset, your subconscious mind thinks attract or attraction, what do you think? Right. Opposites attract, right? I have an attraction to that man or that woman, right? You look attractive. You know, I gotta, I gotta find a way to make myself attractive to this person or I've gotta make my business attractive to my customers so that they can keep coming back. You see what I'm saying? Your mindset now is thinking different. And how do you do this? It's gonna be Something like this. Okay. And these 
uh, right here are steps. Okay, these are steps. And you're attracting individuals who are seeking for what you have. They're seeking your help. Okay, your solution. All right, they need their problems solved. So the first step here for these people to come into this funnel, into this sequence of steps is number one, you need to have a very good lead magnet. All right. So they'll step here. So once this person's, these people are here, you need to do the next step. Lead magnet will be to, um, Follow up by helping. Okay. You want to help. Help. Okay. So when they, when you get them, uh, to your, uh, email, for example, and you send them a follow up email, you want to ask them, Hey, how can I help you? What can I do for you? Okay. This right here will start to, you're going to start to gain trust. And the way you're going to do that again is by providing, provide valuable information that it's really going to help them. Okay. You provide valuable information by doing, for example, webinars. All right. Live Facebooks, uh, live feeds on Facebook, for example. Right. You provide information, valuable information by maybe another, uh, product, uh, offer, uh, not offer, excuse me, product like an ebook. Okay. Maybe a report. All right. Maybe a Q and A, uh, time that you can set up and really, really help them. So by this time right here, they're going to gain trust. This peop this person or people are going to be right here. They're going to start trusting you and liking you. And before you know it, you now have the permission to ask for the sale. And very, very likely, this person, the people here, I keep saying person because it's one, but these people right here that reach this top, they're going to be asking you for what you're offering, your services, your products, or whatever it is that you're offering, that you're doing. Okay? This is why your marketing funnel, if you, if you are not making it work, if you cannot make it work for you, this is why. Because your mindset was hacked, and now I'm showing you the truth behind what you should be looking at, what you should be thinking about. It's not about how much money and how many people you get. It's about how much value and how much trust you gain. You've been hacked. You've been hacked because you've looked at those videos, those companies, these people who are funnel hackers. And when your mindset thinks of hackers, it's something bad. You, you, you don't want to be a hacker. Okay. You want to be an influencer. You want to be a leader. You want to attract the right people into your funnel. Now I'm going to invite you to download my recent report. It is all the skills, at least three of the skills that you as an affiliate marketer should know and start practicing. Um, you've seen the book. I'll show you again. It's right here. All right. Download this. I have, I've, I've basically create the, created this for the purpose of simplifying and making it easy for you to understand what you should be doing in your affiliate marketing business, what you should be doing and what you should be focusing on to get more leads, make more sales. All right. So download it here at eddysand.com slash skills. And of course, I will invite you to subscribe and like, if you like stuff like this, 
let me know right in the comment give me a like show me that you're listening so that i can continue to give you more information like this useful information awesome thank you and i'll talk to you soon peace subscribe like subscribe do all that cool stuff here i appreciate that